All right. So, hello, everybody. Locust Storm here. Just switching over from Twitch to Kick. And I got my setup up and running. So for those who, I guess, haven't seen me before, I'm playing Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And I've done a decent amount of progress so far. So I'll just switch to my map view. This is what I've done so far. I've done a bunch of shrines and a couple of towers. Haven't fully gotten through any of the main story yet, but I am working on that as we speak. As you can see, I'm currently up here with, with, with my buddy Tulin. So. Hang on one minute. There we go, my mic was acting off. So right now we are, I believe, right before the end of the first boss fight, or whatever it is, in that storm over there. We are not going to get to that right this second, because I have some other things I want to do, but this is where we're going to try to end up at the end of today's session, up there fighting this, and hopefully saving the Reno. In the meantime though, I want to explore some more. Possibly find some more shrines to power up, and maybe even some towers to fight, to open up the map. That is the goal for today. So, I think I'll start by actually sending myself right down here. We'll go exploring a little bit. So basically what I want to do is head over to that tower there. And the nice thing is that there's a stable right over here. So I can summon... Oh. Actually, while we're at it, let's just chat right here real quick. Mm -hmm. Hey, Pen. So, it seems like we got a real hill to climb before we have our story. What's our next mm -hmm. step? Let's view the facts. The horse at the heart of all this should be followed to Prince of Zelda, right? Yeah, the animal bolted it as if scared of her? Very strange. Mm. That horse trusted Princess Zelda like no one else. Why did it run away as if it was scared of her? I can't wrap my head around any of this. Was it the princess? Mm. Huge monster. Mm. Okay, I know how to mount horses. Hmm. 
I know, I know, I know. You don't have to tell me all this. Come on, come on. Okay. Distractions are over. Let's get moving. Oh, I hear battle music. I don't see any enemies, though. Oh, never mind. Giant, deadly, three-headed dragon. Okay. We are gonna go right on past that. Buddy. All right. No, jump off. Okay, I guess that's as far as Goliath can go. God, it's pretty close, though. Oh, of course. It's on top of this, like, mushroom platform. So the question is, how do we climb up? Anywhere, really. There surely must be a way. And I think the way is to use the ascension room to fly up there using that pillar. And hopefully don't trigger the frozen monsters. Alright. But <laughs> Wonderful, that puts us up here. We're still below the target. Hmm. Let's see. What if I made my way around here? Two and buddy. Thank you. And then I think my best odds of getting across the gap to there is to climb up here and then glide across. Alright, so buddy, can you help me out? And there we go. Picketa Stone Grove Skyview Tower. Is there going to be an elaborate sub quest here? I don't think so. I'm just trying to see if there are any shrines I can pinpoint. Well, here we go.
become blue. Lovely. Do, 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 do. Thank you for the flint. Now, are there any shrines for me that I can see from here? Hmm. I don't see any. Perhaps it's in my interest to simply engage the tower and go from there. Yep, here we go. Engage. Surface map updated. Oh. That looks interesting there in the top right corner. Is that a maze? Yep, and sky map updated as well. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's a geoglyph. Definitely want to check that out. Hmm. It's a bit of a shame that I don't see a single shrine, but... That's alright. Oh, actually there's one over there. Perfect. We'll head there right after we settle this. Alright, now if I were a tier, I would probably be in the center of this. Is this a Korok? No, it's just a boulder I can roll. That's still cool in its own way. Now, where is this tier? Not in the middle. Perhaps towards the top? Not here. So where are you? Oh, hang on. Got a harvest over here. Let's get those first. Nice fruit. Oh, hello. Lord, my weapons do no damage.
Awesome, I got the glory rush. Thank you for the boomerang. Uh, yeah, let's drop this. Anyway, back to, back to Dragon Tears. It's gotta be somewhere around here. Not here. You a Korok? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Thank you for the seed, little fella, yeah. little buddy. Yeah. Hmm. It's not over here, is it? No, it doesn't seem to be. Hmm. I must be, like, perfectly missing it. Because I know it has to be here somewhere. Oh, but the, the glyph doesn't show up on my map until I actually solve it. I see. Dealing with that right now. All right, surely, surely. Why is why am I struggling so hard to find this? Try exploring the. I guess if you're looking at it, correct. Oh, never mind. It was over here. Okay. The mystery has been solved by accident, but we'll take it. Reveal to me the secrets of the past. So let's see. Queen Sonia! Queen Sonia! Finally. Finally, it is mine! Oh dear. Huh. 
shot Impressive for one Ganondorf and one rock to do. Sonia! You were too late, Rauru. You took for granted the godlike power you had in your hands. Do you now see the potential you squandered? As hmm. She is merely the first victim of your arrogance. You try to control me, Rauru, and you will die knowing that you failed. Can I go? Princeton needs you. So you can teleport multiple people? Hmm. hmm. Ganondorf's happy. <gasps> oh. Okay, so which number was this? This was, that was number eight. I'm just solving these completely out of order. So I got that the Zonai Stone is like super powerful, but it's kind of funny how Ganondorf just getting his hands on one just completely transforms him. Unless, like, maybe those stones are made of a similar thing to the Triforce, perhaps? We haven't really seen it in a while, I don't think. Uh, 
Alright, so there's the destination. But the wall is slippery. Hmm. Oh, hello. Huh. So we have a wheel, a wheel, and a platform. It's not really enough to do anything. And then there's... what's this? Stuff looks like just broken debris. That's not particularly useful. Well, I'll come back to that. There we go. Oh, I see. It's for this guy. Well, we'll come back to you. I don't think I have any items that would let me climb. Oh. Actually, never mind. Okay, even with that, I'm still slipping. <laughs> One, two, three, four, jump. One, two, three, four, jump. One, two, three, four, jump. No, 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 I want to eat. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, jump. One, two, three, jump. One, two, three, four, jump. Darn it! Right at the end. Why is slip resistance not working? Am I missing something here? Hmm. Maybe the better plan of attack is to actually climb that hill and paraglide over. Well, in the meantime, let's chat with you, little buddy. Where do you have to go? You know what? I will deal with that after I solve this shrine mystery. Okay, so I'm guessing the slip resistance potion only works when you're climbing like wet surfaces, not frozen ones. I'm guessing that's the logic there. I did kind of blow through all my stamina items, but I can always make more. Okay. So... Yeah, let's get a bit higher.
think this should do. Or maybe not. Maybe if I shoot him off midair, maybe? Yes, I think we will make it. There we go. Activate, please. Also, is that a glyph in the distance? It is. I think it's the one I already went to. Maybe we'll try out the maze here next. Mallet smash. Hmm. Okay. Please work. There we go. Okay, I see the idea. And I also see a chest over there. So we got the chest, I think. We should put this here. God, I'm like right there. There we go. What you got? Oh, that's actually a pretty nice bow. Let's drop the weaker one. So from the looks of it, we should take this. There we go. And then lastly, we take the rocket. I'll fix you here. And boom. Okay, I just made it. And that's all she wrote. One light of blessing, please. All right. Sweet. All right, so we cleared that area. So where to next? 
Since we're right next door, I think we'll head over to this maze right over here. See what that's about. And while we're at it, maybe we can help this little guy too. Yeah, I think he's where we want to go also. Come with us, little friend. We are going to build ourselves a little cart. Is that just a rock over there, or is that a wheel? You are a rock. Oh, great. Yeah, I'm not risking with you frozen choo-choos. I know you gotta reach a friend, little buddy. We're getting to it. Well, that's not what I wanna do. That is also not what I want. <sighs> Detach, please. Thank you. That is also not what I wanted. Okay. As glorious as building these contraptions is... It can be a right hassle sometimes, especially when the wheel is running away from you. <sighs> Alright, you know what? In the time it would take me to actually go up there, come back, rebuild this, then start again. Oh. Never mind, the wheel responds. Works for me. Why, will you please just stay still? I'm trying to build something. Nope. Ay, ay, ay. No, 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 no. Ah, but of course, the angle's wrong. There we go. That took way too long. Alright. We can finally get out of here. To me. Do, 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 do. Well, here's seeing what happens now. Oop. 
Okay, well this is a little awkward, but hang on. No, don't fall off, Wink. Ay, 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 ay. There we go. Please turn. I think I just might need to reset this. There we go. Okay, go. Okay, well this is kind of weird. I'm digging it though. Oh boy. Ah! This has to be the clumsiest go-kart ever. Okay, now the Korok's on the bottom. You know what? Here. We're already there. So enough silliness. Hello. Thank you for the seeds, little fellows. Try to stick together. North LeMay Labyrinth. I think this place was around in the previous game, wasn't it? Has it been revamped? Yes, I know, Tulin. So what's this say? Research log day one. Zonai glyphs carved into the stone slab read. The dragon ring slumbers in the lab roots deaths. Wake it and ye shall receive due compensation. Taro deciphered them for us, but has since run off to another newly discovered ruin for further study. Writing frankly, I see his absence as an opportunity. Any discoveries that may lie within will be credited to me. My name will be forever tied to solving the mysteries of the Zonai civilization. I gathered a hall of highway and pine cones and will use them to mark my trail in places where I might get lost. Hmm. Oh, I see. I need to fly over there. And I don't have... Wait, actually... No, I got rid of my flame emitter shield, that's right. And I forgot to attach it, and I didn't attach it to one of my other shields. Okay, that was me being foolish. Give me a pine, give me some flint. There we go. Alright, I gotta do it from the menu, that's right. If I wanna hold something, I gotta do it from here. Okay. There we go. Fly over the glue. Fly me to the moon. So you went this way, it seems.
Here's another log. Day 2. I set out with great enthusiasm, but so far I haven't found anything other than an endless supply. A bit of cold. If the Zarnab were going to bother to carve a note into that slab, couldn't they have etched a few hints in there too? How long has that slab been at the entrance to the site anyway? I might be remembering wrong, but I don't think it was there before the upheaval. Yeah. That sounds right to me too. Okay, and I can climb the walls here. Oh, hello. Party Construct Bow. I will take the Mighty Bow, thank you very much. Plant, plant, plant. Where is the plant? Oh, here it is. Let's drop. There we go. What you got for me? Another Zonite bow. Thank you very much. I think I can just scale my way around this gap. Okay, just made it. Alright, following the trail. That leads me to here. Hmm. Now it wants me to go over there. Oh, mushroom. Thank you. I think I can climb past this. Sure, I'm glad I gave myself an extra stamina wheel before attempting this. There we go. I hope I'm going the right way. Where am I in it anyway? Currently I'm over here. Oh, there's another, uh, log. Day 3. After shivering in the cold and cowering from the gloom, I finally made it. This pathway leads to the center of the ruins. There's a trail of lights here that's almost beckoning me in. It must lead to that due compensation the slab mentioned. A history-making discovery is mere steps away. You can do this, B.
Hmm. So is this the path here? Well, I guess we're just gonna keep following the pine cones. Hmm. Interesting. So I can't climb over this stuff. Okay. That should have to do. I think I just sequence broke that slightly. Let's head back over here and get these pine cones. And then climb up here. Oh, hello. Day four. I've done it. At long last, I found a relic of the Zonai civilization. Though my euphoria is short lived. In the hours since my discovery, I've tried touching, hitting, and yelling at the relic, but it remains unresponsive. Hmm. North Lome Chasm. Huh? What's this do? For you who conquered this labyrinth, of the land, I, the ruler of owls, have unlocked the door. Find it on the west side of the labyrinth of the sky. Huh. Is there anything that can be done about this? Okay, this is bad. Great, I'm gonna die. Thank you for spawning that right on me, game. Uh, where should I go? Um... I guess I'll head here. Well, that was super lame. I'm in a tiny room and they spawned that on me. Okay, well since I'm here, let's head on over to that Skyview Tower there and activate it. Fire fruit. Huh, <sighs> well that sucked. Finally found a shrine, then I got blasted. There's Hyrule Castle, floating in the sky. 
Oh no, not again? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. None of that, please. Oh, fish. Hello. Have I been to this shrine before? Yes, I have. It's one that I failed to solve before. Oh, and I remember this tower, too. I tried going to it once and got obliterated by the monsters. Heal up right now. There we go. Okay. I think this time I'll be able to conquer it if I play my cards right. Thank you for not turning the camera game. Okay, that did no damage to him at all. Where are you guys going? Okay, you ran away and now we're fighting again? Oh, come on. I dodged! And I blocked. What the frick? Okay, I dodged backward instead of sideways, but still. <sighs> Alright. Well, I guess forget that then. How's my gear look? Yep, still have the old stuff. Yeah, things are just not going my way right now. That's okay. Nope.
Got some fruit to harvest. I guess for now what I'll do is, I'll head for that tower over there. Oh, and there's a shrine over there too. Wonderful. Thank you for the meat, little foxy. What is that over there? Is that perhaps a great fairy? I'll have to go check that out. But first, I think we have ourselves a stable and a shrine to get to. I hear you, little Korok, buddy. I'll get to you eventually. But not right now. I mean, I gotta say, as far I mean, I'm glad the Korok are a little more... have these little, like, side quests to them now. That give you more seeds. I kind of wish it wasn't the same quest over and over again, but... I do like... The innovation, at least. And I'm not going to make it to the top, am I? Keep jumping, Link. There we go. That was a little awkward. Susuam Shrine. I really don't get where, where the names are coming from. Like, in Breath of the Wild, I think the shrines were named after the monks who were running them, I think. But I think uh, King Rao was the one behind all of these shrines. So the names are just, I don't know what. Or maybe the Zonai who built them gave them those names. The stakes guide you. Oh, is this another- is this a falling ball puzzle? 
Uh, wrong thing. What is this? It's a f okay, so it's not a device. Okay, so hang on. So the goal is to get the ball into there. We have a rotating wheel here. And two platforms to build it with. Is this what I gotta do? Okay, that puts me here. Okay, and this is how I get the chest. Thank you for the arrows. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay, well that was a misfire. There we go. Okay, so now finally, the goal at the end of all this is that we're going to slip this onto the stake here. Uh, 
And that's not gonna work because it's not high enough. Is there any point where I can- Oh, there's a way I can get a, high a higher vantage point. It's right above me. Okay. So, correction, we're gonna fly up here. And now we can move this up to here. Really? Okay, well, how's that? say Actually, I think all I need to do to finish this is stick this Put it in too far. There we go. What? Really? That doesn't work? Okay then. Oh, uh oh. Fine, we'll do it this way. There we go. Okay, that definitely took quite a bit, but we made it. Now I just have to get over there without falling into the pit. There we go. Hello. Yep, I'm visiting the shrine. Light of blessing. And now I have four. Hoorah. Oh, 
All right. That's another shrine down. So I think my next goal should be investigating that giant mysterious plant over there. I want to say that's a great fairy, but I really couldn't tell you, to be honest. It looks like a large gas-emitting cactus. But I think this is a great fairy. Let's see. Examine. Great fairy Kesa. Oh, the nerve are you coming here? Please go away. You're just a monster who's after my blessing of clothing enhancement. The world outside my butt is filthy with gloom and full of monsters. Don't try to deny it. I know it's true. My older sister Tara told me. Even the music I love is gone, and until I hear the sound of a flu down in the world, I'll never go outside again. I moved near the stable to grant my blessings to travelers. If I heard the sound of a flute played by a musician in a troupe, I feel cheered up enough to come out and face the world. Thank you for explaining that to me in such detail. Well, okay. Let's head over to the stable. Outskirt stable. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and check my ledger points. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Ah. 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 Okay, so we got some ruins nearby. Interesting. Any other stories? Yeah, are there any flute players nearby? <laughs> Don't worry about it, miss. What you got? What's on your mind? Uh, they later said they were going to Woodwind Stable in Elden. They haven't returned. Uh, hmm. Oh, we have some Gerudo. Hello. Well, good luck with that, ladies. Do you have anything to say? Hmm. Oh, we have ourselves a little cart right here. Oh, and there's Pen. Let's see what he has to say. Hmm. Oh. You had to investigate the rumors too? I'm having some interesting chirps and warbles. Yeah. Oh, you're also a reporter. I just had a bit of a strange experience, is all. 
Mm. You see, I was by the debris near the three-way intersection when a woman came up to me. Please, please, you have to help her. Her life's in danger. It would only make it worse to reveal who she was, but please, you must save her. That's what she said to me. Mm. The woman sounded desperate, so I followed her. But no matter how I tried, I couldn't keep up. Eventually, I lost track. That's all there is ah. to it. Hey, partner, is that just like you odd about this person whose identity can't be revealed? Mm. If revealing it to strangers is dangerous, does she have someone of great importance? And if her life is already in danger? Well, combining these facts makes me wonder if it isn't a particular important person who would go missing. I can't be sure, of course. But if there's a slight chance, there's only one way for us to know for sure, though. We'll have to pike away at this news and see what the truth is. Mm. Why was that woman staring so hard at my hair? How strange. Well, I guess I'll investigate. Goliath, please. Ah. Goliath, please. Ah. Ah. I know you have no saddles or bridles for. Ah. Do you have to tell me this every single time I show up? Well, let's take a look, see. Oh, that looks like a that looks like someone. Valera. The blonde hair. I do not know who you are, but asking you help me please. My poor regal friend's life's in danger. I can't remember who she is. She's hiding and unable to move. I cannot help her myself. Okay. I noticed that she kept her eyes closed the whole time. Oh, shoot. Oh my god. There we go. There we go.
bouncy stick. So they would always fuse. Yeah, they fuse the mushroom to a stick. God bless these beloved. God bless these fools. Oh my god, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, drop it. There we go. Let me shoot. There. Kind of curious where this is going. Okay, so I need to climb this cliff. That shouldn't be too hard. I don't see any convenient caves to let me like ascend up there. I think I just gotta climb. So that'll be it. Oh, hello. Ah, welcome to the view. Welcome to the session, friend. Whoever you might be. Okay, I just made it there. Recharge, 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 recharge. Up and at him. Think if I go slow and ration my stamina, I'll make it to the top. Well, I'm actually quite high. There's Goliath, and there's my horse way down there. We're almost to the top. I think I'll recharge. Never mind, I won't. Do I have any stamina items left? Nope. Come on, Link, hang on, hang on for dear life. Hang on for dear life. You can do it. Get that stamina bar refilled. Okay. That was a bit close for comfort. Let's just take this nice and slow. We don't gotta rush. I, and literally I jumped right as I said, we don't have to rush. Alright, so no more pressing the jump button. Let's just patiently get to the top. Almost there. Almost there. Oh. 
So close to being there. Okay. Alright, we made it. Now where is that? Here you are. It must be him then. Oh, I am so rude, you have my apologies. Come now, my friend is waiting ahead. Are you gonna have me jump down after I climbed up here? She's waiting nearby, around the debris on the opposite cliff. I will go ahead and let her know you are coming. It's a bit far off, but I know you'll make it. I mean, I can just fly there. Also is... No, 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 that can't be... No, it is. That's the uh, Great Plateau. That was the tutorial area from the previous game. And Goliath is way down there. I guess the climbing up that cliff was not insane. It's been a while. Hasn't it? Alright. So what do we have? Why are we here? I'm sorry for all that. It was important for me to test you. Blonde hair, courage to overcome a challenge, and then another challenge, and then another. Oh, and your disgusting, unwavering commitment to do good. You are Princess Zelda's chosen bodyguard, the Swordsman Link, correct? That's a weird way to test this. <laughs> I'm so glad I can meet you. Now I can take you to the last step in our little journey. <laughs> your grave. The Yiga! Okay, ow. I'm kind of wondering if you guys were rare in this game. Darn it! I died right then. Right then. Okay, or at least it spawned me nearby. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna eat this to get a little spinch of health left back. Um, yeah, my weapons are all terrible. Well, let's try this again, lady. Full blade. Oh my god, seriously? I can't, I can barely even tell their attacks are coming at me. Did that hit me? I was so far away. Um, we'll go with this. Oh my god, what part of I don't... I don't have a weapon equipped. Let's fix that. I'm not trying to escape, I'm trying to... Ugh. How's that? What do you gotta say now? You get foot soldier. I'll... I'll let you off this time. But don't expect such mercy next time. Prepare yourself. Yeah! 
Hey, hey, partner. Well? So this is where your investigation took you. It seems you really got yourself out on a limb there. I was scouting from the skies trying to get to the bottom of the story. I heard that woman was luring people away. I thought I heard her voice, so I swooped down, and hey, here you are. So what have you unearthed? Oh. I see. Who could have guessed this whole story would be an elaborate trap set by the Yiga clan? If you didn't know, they're a group of assassins trying to bring down the kingdom of Hyrule. I heard they were good at disguising themselves, but playing the part of a villager, I never would have guessed. And all to flush out the swordsman who protects the princess. Ah. They thought you, a young and upcoming reporter who just happens to have blonde hair, they believed you were that swordsman? That's bad luck for you. You've definitely got some skills, though. If you can escape from the Yiga clan, I'm proud of you, partner. I'm glad I don't have to write a headline like Junior Reporter Falls to the Cruel Blade of the Yiga in Pursuit of the Truth. Mm. We've worked together to chase two of the stories away to Princess Zelda. Go on and add this to your nest egg, partner. Yay! Oh, there's also this, and some Tracy. So, a Tenno village is dashed up, and Cluda start a new service. Has to do with fabrics. I know, I know. I'm basically giving you an extra job by handing over this fabric, but still. The point is that by accepting and making use of it, you can show you're officially part of Lucky mm. Clover Gazette. It would be nice if Tracy handled things a bit more simply, though. Anyway, that's all done. It's always great working with your partner. Anyway, Simon took off and turned these unusual details into an article. You take care. So long! Okay, so the Yiga are actually still here. I was kind of curious what happened to them. <sighs> there. There. <laughs> okay, making some, getting some weapons. Neat. So one thing I would like to do before I leave this place is find at least one shrine or some object here so I can teleport back. That would be nice. Oh, get away from the bees, not the bees. Okay. Armoranth boosts defense. Cool. There's some blue nightshade. I reckon there has to be at least. Like, there's no way they could have completely ignored this place. There's got to be a shrine or two on the plateau somewhere. Actually, stop climbing here. Let's climb up over there. That seems more sensible. Goodbye, piggy. Go, 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 go. Oh, golden apple. Neat. I don't know what those actually do yet, because I only found one other and I don't want to waste it. So we have ourselves a decent view, but no shrines. Here's the old church from Breath of the Wild. This is where we had to do our, our upgrades. Yeah, the Temple of Time Ruins. There's the big statue.
I am trapped under the water behind the stone gate of the Great Plateau. Okay, that's not what I expected. Trapped behind a stone gate. Interesting. <sighs> well, at least the giant robots have been cleared out. So I don't have to get worried about being laser beamed to death. Oh, there's a person here. Oh. You sell grilled bananas? Ah. Ah. Oh, are you a Yiga? I didn't catch on when they started talking about bananas, because I forgot the Yiga love bananas. Okay, so note to self. If there are people here, they're probably Yiga. Is, is this place where the Yiga have just taken up residence? The Great Plateau? So that tower over there probably services the Gerudo area, so I don't want to go there. Hmm. You know what? I will solve this mystery another day. Because I promised that when I started this episode, I was going to finally go... ...and face... ...the Dorito Storm, and I am going to do that now. So here we go. Hey, Tulin. Oh. Uh -huh. Yes, we do have investigating to do. Okay, so despite all my foibles earlier, I still have a decent amount of food. I have some okay damage weapons, and I have some decent bows. So with any luck, we can do this. Please tell me I make it... Just. Okay. Okay, we got another one. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, that was a misfire. Let's try this again. I didn't think I'd slip, like, right through that little gap. Okay, let's try that again. Alright, so that's where I'm going. So I can just keep my head on it. Here we go. Alright. This time, let's actually make it onto the trampoline. How's that sound? Glide, and then land. Okay, so it looks like I need to actually land on this moving ship. Okay, strong, can't use you yet. Please reload, please reload, please reload. Thank you. 
Okay, there we go. Okay, so we're gonna land here. Uh oh. Okay, saved it. I have to wait for the next boat to roll in. Here it comes. Okay, so I need to climb my way up these boats. That's the idea. So in that case, I'm gonna work my way around counterclockwise to make it easier for me to get to them. Oh ho! That looks pretty promising over there. Assuming I can make it. There we go. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Well, we're getting near the top now. So I think now we just gotta fly down into the middle. Let's hit the eye of the storm. And there she is. One large boat. Wind Temple. The legendary Stormwind Ark. No, so this is a full temple, not just a uh, location. And it has Zonai guards. Hmm. Wow, so this is what was waiting for us in that huge cloud. This is the Stormwind Ark from the kids' song. Huh? Princess Zelda? Huh? Whoa! He said whoa and the subtitle is awk. Awkward. <laughs> what the? <laughs> this proves it, Link. The blizzard that's been pounding Rita Village is coming from there. Hey, didn't I see someone here a minute ago? Weird. I could swear they were just here. It looks like I can activate this, so let's see what happens. Okay, I got a teleport marker. All these gears start lowering. Okay, so the door tries to open, but can't. Looks like it's shut tight, but the source of the blizzard has got to be right under that hatch. Isn't there some way we can get it open? Huh. That sound! There it is again! Brave Fletchling. There are still five locks securing the hatch on the deck. Use your power to release all five locks, and the hatch should open. 
Oh, even getting one of map markers. My words. Okay, I sure I heard it for sure this time. It was calling out to me loud and clear. The source of the blizzard messing up the village has got to be under this hatch. If that voice was right, it'll open once we find a way to release all five locks. We're so close. Come on, Link. Let's go figure out how to open up those locks. Why is there a frozen choo-choo up here? Okay, so there's this frozen choo-choo here. Cool. Alright. So I think I'm getting the idea here. Oh. Thank you, Tulin. Except the blizzard took the spoils away. That's a cannon. Okay, well I think I understand the idea here. We need to explore this arc, undo all the locks, and then face the big bad underneath. But I think I will save this for next time. There is one more thing I want to do before I cut things out here. And that is... Let's just head over to Rito Village. So I've come back to Rito Village, basically because it should be right over here. Here we are to meet the goddess statue. Park container, please. Bring peace to the world. I sure hope to. All right. There we go. Oh, oh hey, Tulin. <gasps> yes, I am back. Alright, so I think this will wrap us up for today's episode. We got a bit more power, explored a bit of some areas, and we unlocked all of this, this giant boat right here. So tomorrow, well, not tomorrow, but um, next time we'll explore the ruins. And have fun with that. Hopefully get to the bottom of this blizzard already. I just want to say thank you to those who decided to watch me for even a little bit of time. And to everyone in general, hope you're having a good day. Locust Storm, signing out.